over Europe and in some cases into CENTCOM and we provide all of the communications, telephones, computers, and things of that nature to make NATO headquarters able to talk and effectively control NATO operations. Uh, we get to work with a multinational as well as joint service and we entrust our leaders to go out to these different locations to conduct exercise in a mission command type philosophy that we like to utilize. This has just definitely been a, a very great assignment. Uh, so far, I've been pushed in the forefront of a lot of things, and we have a term that we call ourselves here. We're not platoon sergeants, we're mission commanders, because once we go out on mission, we as East Seven and South First Classes have to make decisions that usually majors are making, or some people are higher are making. So it, it's definitely been a very great eye-opener for me, and definitely helped with, with me in going forward in my career. Uh, it's a it's a good experience working with NATO. Um, there's a lot of opportunities uh, as far as uh, traveling to other countries and seeing how those guys operate and just getting to know the different cultures uh, around the world and, and being immersed in it. Uh, got to uh, deploy as an augmentee. Um, met up with two other Romanian guys from the other DCMs and we actually went for an air policing mission uh, dealing with uh, the British and the Romanian Air Force and it was an experience because we got to see how a foreign culture Air Force operates and we got to be a part of that, that, uh, that exercise that they, they just started. So the equipment that we put our hands on is significantly different than what the rest of the Army uses and certainly what the rest of the Joint Force uses to, to provide the same sort of digital reach back for the supported headquarters. The system is a deployable system. You get to actually work on the security and, and mess around with the servers a little bit. It's opposed to the other side of the house where you're just using the uh, routers and switches. You get to see another side that you don't normally get to see anywhere else. We enjoy the Naples community, uh, just so much to do here, the history going out to Rome, going out to some of the neighboring uh, uh, European countries. So it's a number of opportunities that soldiers that come to the um, 2nd NATO Signal Battalion have that not only they can enjoy as soldiers, but their families as well. Our family members get involved in the MWR program, USO programs, and they take them all over the place as well. Italy is just a beautiful country. It's so rich with history. Uh, I'm really one who loves history, and uh, since I've been here, I've already gone to Pompeii and a lot of the historical sites, and it's just so beautiful and nice to see. Naples has a lot of things to do, a lot of things to see. The history is amazing and the food is awesome. I, I love it. Um, it. The culture is so thick and so rich and the people here are so passionate. It's, it's really cool to see. The 2 sb is an awesome unit. It's definitely a broadening uh, unit and one that will definitely enhance your career.